Dr. Patrick Nzana Olomo, the head investment and mobilization of resources, AU Department of Economic Affairs, said the KDEP framework and the Malabo Declaration needs to be implemented fully by the member states. We have, for instance, the KDEP the CADEP uh, framework which is promoting agriculture in Africa. We have the Malabo Declaration that was aiming at you know, accelerating progress towards you know, agricultural transformation. So these you know, uh, programs need to be implemented fully by our member states and we call upon our member states you know, to make sure that they are able to implement the policies that are in place. 23% of sub-Saharan Africa's GDP stems from agriculture according to the World Bank. At the EU-Africa Business Summit, it was also agreed that the EU-Africa trade partnership in the sector must now focus on smallholder farmers. This was the position of former EU Commissioner for Agriculture, Phil Hogan. We are stand ready in the European Union to work with our partners in the African Union and all of the countries to generate the necessary finance, the technical knowledge and all the partnerships and alliances that are required in order to make this happen. But the farmer must be at the center of the action. The EU is one of Africa's largest trade and investment partners. Its foreign direct investment stock in Africa in 2020 was at 222 billion euros, compared to 42 billion euros from the US and 38 billion euros from China.